Seriously on the Beach House. Beck and Mike have been gone for like two weeks. The bandits got us and stole Mystery's clue on our channel. That's where they've been. You thought you could have smarter. We need to get them back. So these guys said that they needed the unicorn horde to trade back. This should work. I'll trade them this one. We have been trapped in this garage for weeks now. I'm gonna reach my hand over and I might be able to reach the padlock to put in the code. It's open. We got it. We gotta run. We gotta run. I know they're here. And I'm gonna have to trade this for him. Hopefully this works. He's here, Becca. He's here. It's Ryan. I have it. But I, I don't want to give it to you unless you show me the second mic. Give me the beach house. Psst, Ryan. We're here. If you want it, go get it. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I grabbed this <gasps> out of that chest. Oh my goodness, what is that? Did you guys miss <laughs> us? <laughs> so. Becca. Becca? What is that? Becca, Becca, Becca. With my head in the clouds and my feet on the back, we go chasing the sun and we'll follow the map. Crazy. It was a doozy. Literally, I doozed. I can't believe I fainted. I was not feeling very good. All of a sudden, I just started feeling really sick. And then that thing on my neck, that was so weird. But I've looked at it this morning. It's fine. It's like gone down a lot. It doesn't look anything like it did last night. That was like, I wondered if I like got a bug bite or something, but. Anyways, today is the day we are gonna go and, does my hair look good? Miss this spot a little bit. Good enough, okay. So, today we're gonna go and see if we can find the next clue from Mr. E. We've got that decoder pin now, and I think it's time to move forward, move on, and see if we can get the, the clue all the way from Lava Hot Springs decoded with the new decoder pin that we got, and then we'll be able to see if we can go treasure hunting today. So what do you think? Better? Yeah, I'm feeling completely fine. I feel really good, actually. Like, better I feel than ever. better than ever, actually. I think we're good to go. We just gotta decode this, decode the clue. But what about the thing that was on your neck? It's gone. Like, well, I mean, it's still there a little bit, but it's just faded away. I think I must have gotten a bug bite or something. I feel a lot better after getting okay. a shower. I mean, we were in, I saw a lot of spiders in there, so. After getting a shower, I feel great. Yeah. Well, okay. I'm glad you're feeling better. Yes. So should we try to solve this clue for Mr. E? Yes, let's solve the clue and see where it takes us. All right, James. So what we're doing right now is getting the clue from Mr. E put back together so that we can use the decoder pin to solve Wait, it. Actually, I thought the one started here because the last time I saw it, the one started there. But now the one starts here. All right, let's get a good look at that decoder pin actually. So if you look really closely at it, you can see that you got an inner alphabet and an outer alphabet. Oh, are you already standing? Yeah, we're just looking at this clue. I'm um, trying to see if we can figure out how to use this decoder pin. It looks like there's a hole above the little monster's face. And if you look through the hole, there's like a numbers there. So there's a one, and a two, and a three, and a four. If you look down inside, I think that might have something to do with it. Together. Oh wait, I think that one goes up here. Ah. Okay, I think this is the right one. <gasps> Objects and message are larger than they appear. A whole bunch of letters. And, L I did and that there's a number one here, too. So let's try and see if we can use this decoder pin to solve this message. Okay, if it starts with an A, then T, right? A. Oh, okay, so I'm gonna take Here's the A right here, and I'm gonna put this on T, the smaller one. 
Oh wait, no, wait, maybe? Let's just... Okay, so, so I'd have to have this one be the little A. So then let's put the little, let's put the next one on T. Do you think that this one means anything? Hmm. Step one? Step one! Step one! There's got to be more steps. It has the number 19. It has a whole bunch of numbers. That's all numbers. If you spin it, it's a whole bunch of different numbers. Okay, so let's... <gasps> Objects and message are, are larger than they appear. Why would it have to say that? Hmm. Do you have any ideas, Corbin? If A and T are the first words, that must mean at. Like, at a place. A, T, O, H, D, C. Z, Could you read the words up here again? Objects and message are larger than they appear. Okay, James, go get me a piece of paper and a pencil. Yes, Mom. Thank you. There's numbers on the inside. Four, three, two, one. What if we have to line up the one here, and then we can use, like, what if that's the, what's the word that they use for, like, the code that you have to have? <gasps> so the decoder print is set to one, and oh. if objects and message are larger than they appear, then let's try reading the clue and then maybe oh. go up to the larger alphabet, because you've got a small alphabet and a large alphabet. Objects and messages are larger than they appear. Okay, okay, so, so I get it. So then if it's set to one, then we need to keep this set this way. Right. And that means that the A, the is letter is getting a B. A B. Okay, so because the objects in message are larger than they appear. All right. So that means that A is a actually, is actually a B. B. T T is actually a U. U. O O is actually an R. R. H is actually an I. D is actually an E. And C is actually a D. Buried. Does buried. that say word? Buried. It's working. It's working. Okay. Let's get the next of it. Let's get the next. Okay. Q is R and J is K. Park. I was like Bartholomew Park and and it said that. It says Bartholomew Park. So buried at Bartholomew Park. So we know exactly where it's at. Yeah. Okay. Hey. Wait. Yeah. We're probably going to need to get the metal detector. Let's get everybody ready to go and then let's go to Bartholomew Park and okay. see if we can find this buried I treasure. Little, I think I know where we have a little shovel we can use. Okay. So that, so let's, that be perfect. let's grab it. Ready to go on an adventure. Okay, we are at Burger King getting some waters and hey, burgers. You okay? What? You alright? Yeah. Okay. We're getting some waters and some hamburgers and we're going to be getting some stuff for dinner just so that we can all be fed and happy while we're out treasure hunting. All right, we got the hamburgers, handing them out. Ow! Are you okay? <sighs> What's wrong? Yeah, I'm okay, I'm fine. Is it on your neck where it hurt, where you got hurt last um, No, I mean. Let me see. No, you don't, like it'll be fine. I, I don't think there's anything really wrong with it, I just. Are you sure? Yeah, I mean, night. I I'm think I just you. tweaked my neck or something. Okay. So. We're here. I am so excited. <laughs> okay, guys. Time for a fun adventure today. We've got this message that there's something buried at Bartholomew Park. And we're here at the park. The kids are just going to go look around. Everybody just got done eating, so we're, everyone's feeling a lot better. All right, you ready to come, Charlie? Yeah. Let's go play. I'm gonna stay and eat for a minute. Okay. Are you sure you're feeling okay, babe? Yeah, I'm feeling fine. Why? Okay, just because you've been acting a little bit weird today. Mm, I'm good. I think it, yesterday was just weird, but I'm good now. Okay. Let's go look for this clue, guys. Swimsuit. That's okay. We don't need a swimsuit. All right, Corbin, did you get the metal detector? Yeah. All right, you know how to use it, right? Yep. Okay. Let's not go in the water. Back and we'll let him try it for just a few minutes and then we'll trade. So there's a whole bunch of beach area here at the pond. 
we're thinking that maybe if we look around, we might find something buried. So we're gonna look around with the metal detector and see what we can see. Oh, you're right. There is kind of a bump all the way along. That is interesting. Should we follow it? Let's follow it, yeah. And Ellie's got the shovel, yeah. so she's ready to dig in case we need to dig anything. Good job. Rebecca's still at the van finishing her salad, but I'm really actually worried about her. And I know she keeps saying that, oh, it's okay and it's fine, but the way she's acting lately has been kind of strange. But like, I don't want to force her to, I don't know, she just is acting weird. I don't know what to do, you guys. James's turn, trying to do some metal detecting. Anything so far? Nothing yet. Is the metal detector working? I think so. Cool, little army man. Oh. That's awesome. James thinks he found something with the metal detector. So Ellie's digging and we'll see what we can find. This is fun, even if we don't find any treasure. What is that? Oh, sty styrofoam, garbage. Kids are starting to get wet and play in the water and get dirty. <gasps> Dad said something. I think I found something over here. Hey, Dad said he found something. Grab all your shoes, grab all your shoes. Don't forget them. Because this tells you how deep it is. Oh. And it's all been like six inches or really, really deep. Oh. Look, I found something over here that's showing up as really shallow. Look, it's right on the surface. Can you see oh, that? Oh, okay. So I think that there might be something right here. So let's see if there's anything there. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. <gasps> what cool. is that? Just look at what we found. It says something. Ovaltine. Does it say Ovaltine? It's like... A it looks old. Hmm. Interesting. <gasps> it says Mr. E. Oh, it does! Look at that. Chocolate. These look like chocolate coins. I think okay. they're the chocolate coins. Okay. Well, let's read the clue and see what it says. Okay. Let's look at this clue. Mr. E. Mr. E. <gasps> it's got numbers. What if it has a code for something here in this Do you think park? this is latitude and longitude? I do. That looks like latitude and Mr. longitude. Mr. E's done this before. Remember when he oh. gave us the, the first clue, when he gave us the motorhome? <gasps> That's right. We had coordinates that we had to follow. That's right. So I think. Let's go to the same place. Okay, then. let's go home and let's type in the latitude and longitude to the computer and see where it takes us. Okay. Let's go. To All the right. Same place. Let's go. Ah. Woohoo! I am so glad that we were able to find the treasure today. I feel like that was awesome and that was a really fun just excursion with the family anyway. Even if we haven't found the final treasure or anything like that, the it's just fun. The kids were getting so messy and dirty. They were. But they were having a great time playing in the sand and in the water. They really were. It was really fun. And it was, but by the time we were ready to go, I was ready to go. They're all gonna need baths and need to, I'll have to clean them up when we get home. <laughs> we'll go and uh, look up the coordinates and see where we're gonna be going. If we have time to do it tonight, then we'll do it tonight. If not, then we'll have to do it tomorrow. We found the treasure. Okay, so we just got home and we need to put those numbers into the computer so we can try to find out where Mr. E wants us to go next. But I can't seem to find it anywhere. Have you seen the clue from Mr. E? I thought I had it in, with me in the van, but now I can't find it anywhere. I just, I just got done looking in the van. No, not that one, the one that we just found. Have any of you guys seen the clue from Mr. E? I can't find it anywhere. Where did it go? Where's the bandit store? Ellie, do you know where the clue is? Corbin? Well, I do. I did hear something over in the Do you know where the clue is? No. Where? What did you the last seat then? Last time we had it was we were in the van. We just barely got in the van and we were coming home and I had it with me and I can't find it anywhere. I, I just barely had it. The whole container is gone. Where? Um, oh, I do remember. Where? Oh, yeah. Oh, good. I was so worried about it. Oh, my goodness. All right, let's I was so it. nervous that it was gone. And I thought maybe a bandit had taken it or something. Okay, so let's go to um, Google Maps and let's put in those coordinates and let's see what. I'll do it. Time. Just give me the clue. No, I'll do it. Okay. okay, here. Oh, 
All right. Just put it in the coat. I will. I'll put it in. Oh, you know what? We I needed something else from the van. What do you need? I'm gonna need all of you guys to go get it for me. Go get it from the van. I, it will go bad. You too, Ellie. I need you to go. I need you to go. Can I go? Yes, you too. Everyone. The bandits need this information. I better put it in here and get the coordinates to them as soon as possible. I know exactly where that's at. I need to get this information to the bandits as fast as possible. Oh. What am I doing? Michael? Why is he not here? We have the clue. Michael, do you have the camera out? Okay, are we gonna film the next part of the treasure hunt? It's right here. Oh. Oh, okay. So, did you put in the coordinates? Oh, I guess I... I guess I did. That's really funny. So, where are we going? Okay, so these are the coordinates. Is that right? Did I even type that or did you type that? Oh, you you didn't do it right here. Oh, I don't know. You gotta put um, a comma and a space. Oh, okay. And let's see if that works. Did you type that it's in just, though? No, I didn't type it in. Oh. I was out in the van because you told me to go get something. Did I? I don't, I don't remember typing it in, but okay. All right, whatever. Let's just move on to the. So let's. Uh, is this the Zoom middle of the ocean? Let's see. Oh, looks like Ooh. the ocean. Wait. Oh. Where's this? Oh, that's Utah Lake. Oh, that's Utah Lake. So do we need to go out to the middle of the lake? Look at my camera! Awesome! <laughs> let's go out in the middle of the lake. snorkeling gear. We have to get snorkel gear. We might. And then we get my kayak. Excuse you. <laughs> I don't know. Do time to do it today? I don't we think we're going to have time. It's so almost down. sunset. The sun is going down. Okay. Um, it's starting to get late. It's, it's actually dinner time. It's after 7 p.m. Oh, wow. Okay. We should probably get all the kids dinner and get everybody to bed. And then first thing tomorrow morning, we should head out to the lake and go see if what we can find. I think that'd be really great. Let's call it Okay, and we and James has awesome. a kayak too that we can use. Yes. So that'll be really so fun. fun. Oh. Looking good. Almost a bandit. Oh, I can't find anything to wear in this house. that up. Oh, that looks terrible. <sighs> Don't they have anything that looks good? Oh. Mom, <laughs> do you have a, a hat by chance that I could borrow from Dad? Uh, anything that looks kind of like a cowboy hat? Let me see. No, terrible. Are you sure there's no cowboy hat in here? I'll go find it. Mom! Mom! What? I'm coming. Fine. <gasps> I saw... I saw on their channel that they got a cowboy hat from one of us bandits a long time ago. I'm just gonna see if I can find it. Oh! Michael, 
Do you know where there might be? Oh, do you remember when uh, when you found that cowboy hat from the bandits? I mean. Uh, yeah, that was a long time ago. Where is it? Probably in your costume room. Oh, thanks. But you put it in there. Yeah. Oh, I oh I know. I just forgot. Much better. What are you? Are you a bandit? <gasps> no, no, <laughs> no. Just, I just like this style. Now to find that real unicorn horn. Michael? Yeah? Where's the unicorn horn? You know where it is. It's in our closet. Oh, that's right. I just forgot. Of course it is, honey. It's in this chest. Oh, thanks. Thank you, Corbin. Okay, everybody out. Thanks so much, sweetie and uh, dearie. Out. Out, out. Finally. I finally found it. All this time, it was just here. So proud of me. <laughs> oh, yes. Finally. Now I need to get these children away from me. They're everywhere. I don't even know what their names are. They're just under my feet all day. Shoo. Okay. Shoo, little girl. <laughs> Shoo shoo! <laughs> now that I've found the unicorn horn, I need to take advantage of this place that I'm in right now. They don't even know that I'm a bandit. I need to find out as much information as I can about that YouTube family and find where they hid the bandit's cash. I can't believe they took it from us in the first place. Uh, Michael? Yeah? Oh, where did we, uh, put that treasure chest with the... The, the cash in it. Why are you asking for all this stuff? Oh, just no reason. Just, I'm trying to organize the closet. We spent all that at Disney, don't you remember? <sighs> no. Why? You remember. Oh, yes, of course. Is everything okay? Yeah, I'm totally fine. Where's the treasure chest at least? Is it still up there? Yeah. What treasure chest? The one that the bandit's cash came in. It should be in our room. Yeah, it should be in our room. Maybe they didn't notice. I'm hoping that they didn't notice that it was a false bottom and that it had more than just cash in it. Where is it? This is such a messy room. Where is it? Getting close, I, I can feel it. <gasps> there it is, there it is. Oh, perfect. Oh, we found it. Oh. Okay, maybe they haven't opened it yet. What else do I need before I go back to the bandits camp and join my allies? Ah. An idea. I'm going to ask Michael, see if I can get as much information about that YouTube family as possible before I leave. And as soon as we're able to get all of the treasures built in together to be able to be one giant treasure, then we'll be able to find the final treasure. Time to go do some spy work. Oh, and I have to act like that stupid hubby, Rebecca. Ugh. Oh from the videos, always burping and giggling and blah, blah, blah. 
Now I have to act like that. Well, here goes. Much better than ever before. Full of energy and life. <sighs> but you look like you've got dark rings under your eyes. Oh no, I'm just trying a new look. <laughs> Come sit by me. With the cowboy hat, really? That's the bandit's hat, you know. I like it. What is this? Oh, Why do you have this? I'm... I thought you were organizing the closet. I you shouldn't just be walking around with this. Is there a chip on it? Did you chip it? Didn't mean to if I did. Why do you even have this? Oh, just it should be in the caring chest. for it. I'm just taking care of it. Anyways, come here, sweet babe. What do you want? You're acting strange. <laughs> Nothing. I'm not doing anything. <laughs> I'll take that. Thank you. Howdy. Anyways, I was just wondering if you talked to David from that YouTube family recently. No, but I could. Oh, yes, I would love it. Just reach out to him. I, I would like to go visit him at his house. I don't think they're at their house right now. Well, where are they? I can check if you want. Of course, I would love that. Why? Oh, just a visit. Be friendly. You're Friends. acting so strange. No, this is how I normally act, of course. Right, well, I'll message him, see what he's doing. I would also like to know uh, where they are hiding all of the treasure that they've found. I don't even know. They haven't even told me. Mm, of course they've told you. They would have they would have told you. I don't know where it is. Why are you acting like this oh, anyway? Oh, nothing, nothing. <laughs> well, it's time to get the kids to bed. Okay, I'll let you do that. This has been easier than ever to infiltrate the beach house and get all of the treasure for the bandits. I am so happy with how all of the things are coming together. <laughs> Hiding from them is so hard, they're everywhere. It's like there's a million of these beach kids. All right, it's time to call Doc. Doc, this is previously Rebecca Beach. You'll be pleased to know that I have tracked down the unicorn horn, the lost bandit's cache, and the treasure chest from the lost bandit's cache. And not only have I done that, but I have also found out information for you all about where the treasure is hidden from the beach house and that YouTube family. And there's one last thing. The Beach family will be at these coordinates tomorrow. Make sure to be there. Get that treasure before they do. They won't know what hit them. <laughs> when we were kids, just hanging at the playgrounds, when all we 